hello everyone you are welcome in this video i'm going to evaluate w of 16 raised to power 5 minus 16 raised to power 4 without using a calculator so let's try how can we find the value of this simplification math problem now here first of all we will change these two bases 16 to its exponential form so here we can write 16 as 2 raised to power 4 or 2 raised to power 4 whole raised to power 5 minus 2 raised to power 4 whole raised to power 4 now here in these two terms we will use an exponential math property and we will multiply the powers with each other so here in this state we will use this one exponential math property r raised to power m whole raised to power n can also be written as r raised to power m times n so by using this exponential property here in this equation we will multiply the powers with each other so this equation will become first term will become 2 raised to power 4 times 5 is 20 so this will become 2 raised to power 20 minus this will become 2 raised to power 4 times 4 is 16 so this will become 2 raised to power 16 now next we can write these two powers as we can write 2 raised to power 20 as 16 plus 4 minus now this power will be the same 2 raised to power 16 and here in this one term we will use another exponential math property and we will split these two powers over the number 2 so here we will use this one exponential math property in the first term a raised to power m plus n can also be written as a raised to power m times a raised to power n so again using this exponential property here this equation will become the first term will become 2 raised to power 16 times 2 raised to power 4 minus 2 raised to power 16 now what we will do here here 2 raised to power 16 is common so let us take out 2 raised to power 16 common so this will become 2 raised to power 16 times here 2 raised to power 4 is left minus here only 1 is left now further we can write this equation as 2 raised to power 16 times now what is the value of 2 raised to power 4 2 raised to power 4 means we need to multiply 2 4 times so 2 times 2 is 4 4 times 2 is 8 and 8 times 2 is 16 so the value of 2 raised to power 4 is 16 minus 1 now 16 minus 1 is 15 so this will become 2 raised to power 16 but we can write this 16 as 10 plus 6 times this gives him 15 now here in this one term again we will use this one exponential math property and we will spread these two powers over 2 so this will become 2 raised to power 10 times 2 raised to power 6 times 15 now here we will try to multiply all of these three numbers so first of all we will change these two exponential numbers to its value so here 2 raised to power 10 is a very famous number which is equal to 1024 now 2 raised to power 6 is here the value of 2 raised to power 4 is 16 so multiplying 2 2 times with 16 we give, it gives him 16 times 2 is 32 and 32 times 2 is 64 so the value of 2 raised to power 6 means multiplying 2 6 times gives him 64 times 15 here we need the product of these three numbers so here first we will try to multiply these two numbers we can multiply these two numbers in the work by simple method but here i will multiply these two numbers with a different way that is a better longer but very simple so let's try and learn this one method this number will be the same 1024 times here we can write 64 as 60 plus 4 times we can write 15 as 10 plus 5 now we multiply these two numbers first we multiply 60 with these two numbers first with 10 then with 5 and then we multiply 4 with 10 and 5 so this multiplication is longer but very simple 
this number will be the same 1024 times now 60 times 10 is 600 plus 60 times 5 is 300 plus now 4 times 10 is 40 and 4 times 5 is 20. Now let us add these four numbers. So the addition of these four numbers gives him 1024 times now 600 plus 300 is 900 and 40 plus 20 is 60. So it is 960. Now again here you can write these two numbers as this can be written as 1000 plus 24 times this can be written as 900 plus 60. Now again here you multiply these two numbers with the same way like this one. So first we multiply this 1000 with 900 and then 60. So this will become 1000 times 900 plus no 1000 times 60 plus we will multiply 24 with 960 so this will become 24 times 900 plus 24 times 60 and let's multiply these numbers with each other so this will become here 900 times 0 is 0 900 times 0 is 0 900 times 0 is 0 900 times 1 is 900 so the product of these two numbers gives him 900,000 plus now 60 times 0 is 0, 60 times 0 is 0, 60 times 0 is 0 and 60 times 1 is 60. So this gives him 60,000 plus no 24 times 0 is 0, 24 times 0 is 0, 24 times 9 is here, 9 times 4 is 36. So 6, they will be carried. 9 times 2 is 18, 18 plus 3 is 21. So this will become 21,600 plus no 24 times 0 is 0 and here 24 times 6 is 6 times 4 is 24. So 4, 2 will be carried. 6 times 2 is 12, 12 plus 2 is 14. So this gives him 1,440. Now finally we will add all of these four numbers. So here we will start from the ones position. So this gives him 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0 is 0. Now next 4 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0 is 4. Now next 4 plus 6 is 10. 10 plus 0 is 10 and 10 plus 0 is 10. So this will become 0. 1 will be carried to the next number. So 1 plus 1 is 2, 2 plus 1 is 3, 3 plus 0 is 3 and 3 plus 0 is 3. So this will become 3. Now next 2 plus 6 is 8, 8 plus 0 is 8. And here is only one digit that is 9. So finally 983,040. This is our answer and value of This nice and interesting simplification math problem. Now in last if you like this video so don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel. Thanks for watching.